the Cheshire Oaks next. This is for the three-year-old fillies, and it's an Oaks trial for next week. Um, let's take a look at the field for this one, the rain coming down. It's only a listed race, this one. I don't know why the fillies race is only a listed race when the Colt race is a group race. Doesn't seem very fair. So now have Valento Rider at the top. For Dan Hughes has also got Alba Flora, Euphoric, Paul Rhodes, Excello Pound, David Robertson, Money Pit, Joshua Sutherland, Palmdale Greed, Vinnie Gerard, Such a Lady David Hooney, Time for Success, Leon Van Rensburg and Trapanga Bridge for Darren Thompson. All installed and ready to go. And away they go. And we've got three greys in this, two closest to us, both for Dan Hughes. Going to make my job difficult isn't it but it's Halba Flora who's the one who's to the four of those greys at the moment but the leader right over on the far side is Euphoric with time for success in second then Money Pit is back in third Palm Brown Green is after that one and then comes Valento Rider but they're sorting themselves out now they're going up past the screen and the winning post they've got a complete circuit of the Chester track to go and Euphoric is clearing the lead by a good three lengths or so. With them pretty much in a bunch on the inside, Trapanga Bridge in the maroon jacket will probably be second coming out of this turn. Vinnie Gerrard's grey is palmed out green in the green. That one's close up as well. Leon Van Rendenburg's dark blue jacket is time for success. The one in the pink and the turquoise is now coming through his XLO pound for David Robertson. David Hooley's purple jacket in such a lady is also trying to go through the inside, Alba Flora is the current back marker, that's the second of the two, Dan Hughes Gray is the other one, he's Valento Rider and that's wide on the track, just rolling around on the track a little bit, also towards the rear, Joshua Sutherland's black and red hoops of money pit, but they've got four and a half to go, and Euphoric is in the lead by about a length to XLO Pound in second, and time for success in third, these three are clear of money pit, who's now moving into fourth, Palmdale Greed is next, then comes Trapanga Bridge, such a ladies after that one, and then Valento Rider and Alba Flora are both going to need to get going soon, but it's Euphoric who's in the lead, Euphoric's been in the lead all the way, leading by a couple of lengths to time for success in second as they start the swing into the straight, Excello Pound is still there in third, Trapanga Bridge is running into himself into a bit of a pocket, Money Pit is trying to quicken the greys are all trying to come with a sweep round the outside of the track headed by Alba Flora but it's in the lead Euphoric, Euphoric is two lengths clear of XLO Pound who now comes to strike inside the final point and it's XLO Pound who bursts into the lead between the two of them no time for success he's trying to come through but it's going to be XLO Pound I think he's going to take it XLO Pound races up towards one tanks if I don't know it's XLO Pound the winner from time for success to Brandon Bridge then Euphoric Valento Ryder was the fastest finisher of the greys and one or two disappointments in that race, but David Robertson will be happy enough with Excello Pound taking the Cheshire Oaks. So Excello Pound for David Robertson, the winner. Time for success, Leon Van Rensburg was second. Trapanga Bridge, David uh, Darren Thompson was third. Euphoric Paul Rhodes was fourth, and Valento Rider for Dan Hughes was fifth.